Hey, good afternoon, guys. Uh, Ron here, Precision Sales, doing a walk around of an in stock sale. This is a beauty, guys. This is a main sale. Uh, let me just read out some of the measurements here. We've got a, uh, a luff length here of 27 feet 5 inches. Uh, leech here is 29 feet 2 inches. And the foot is 10 feet 7 inches. Now, this has a bolt rope that slides up the mast, and that's 8 millimeters, is the diameter of that bolt rope. Uh, we've got a loose foot here. And we've got a uh, Velcro strap to attach the clue. So uh, this is uh, a really, really nice sail. We've got uh, four partial battens on it and one reef point. So if this uh, fits your rig uh, with the bolt rope going up the mast, this would be an excellent, excellent buy. Never been used. Uh, I believe the miscommunication was this gentleman wanted sliders to go up his mast. Uh, so this, uh, I do believe, is ready to rock and roll. Originally built for a... Um, Nordic uh, folk, folk boat, um, but uh, it, it doesn't matter what it was built for. If it fits, let's get it out there and get it in the wind. So let's start down here in the uh, clue corner and I'll show you how this attaches. So we've got a Velcro strap that will wrap around your boom. So if you have an outhaul, uh, this will attach to your outhaul and work really, really well. Uh, this piece of uh, batten here with the pointy end to it, that's uh, used to uh, tuck the batten pockets in once the battens are in there. Uh, this is the way the sail comes. It comes in a, in a stuff sack drawstring bag with a sail tie. And there's the battens. They're all coiled up, uh, ready to go. So uh, when you get your sail, it'll all come in one box. Now let's get back to the sail here and uh, just look at these reinforcements on the clue. This is our 300 series Dacron. So uh, really nice uh, quality, good price point on it. Just walk down the foot. As I said, brand new, never been sailed. Uh, as I said, I think there was just a bit of a miscommunication between us and the producer, uh, the manufacturer. Here we are down at the tack corner. You can see the foot line there for tensioning it with a nice little uh, cleat. Nice reinforcements on it. And here's the bolt rope as it goes up. You got a cutting ham there, but the bolt rope goes, uh, and that's 8 mil, as I said. Reef point, single reef point on this guy with a nice reef belt across it. If you're so inclined, you could uh, go ahead and put some sliders on this if you wanted to. All you need to do is put grommets in it uh, and then web on some sliders. And that uh, certainly is a project that a sailor could do himself or uh, take it to a local loft uh, might be something to do. Uh, for our used sales, we do get them all boxed up and ready to go. So we would just ship it to you and you could take care of that. Um, not a very difficult situation there. Um, let's take a look at this head plate. Really quite nice, well reinforced, like the webbing coming down the uh, leech there. And let's just walk on down the leech. So, uh, as I said, guys, this is this is the backside actually. So maybe we'll uh, we'll flip it over and you can take a look at the uh... there we go. So we can just take a quick look at this batten. So this is what we call a uh, a Velcro batten enclosure, and that stick that I showed you earlier is going to fit in here and you're going to tuck it to follow that batten in so that it can't come out and then we've got the little string there so that you can pull it back out if need be but it's it's more of a leave it and forget it kind of system great for cruisers that uh, aren't too worried about batten tension that kind of stuff and just kind of set it in there and forget it so beautiful sail no stains no rips no tears Never been on a boat, I don't think. As I said, it was a miscommunication. Brand new sail. Let's get it out in the wind, guys. Double check your measurements. Uh, link below, or you can purchase it directly off our website. Thanks very much.